I want to say shout out to Trayvon Stags for sponsoring my outfit. Um, actually, my ugly sweater. This is his. Um, I think I'm just going to make it mine at this point. And also, thank you to my best friend for sponsoring these socks. Uh, they're so adorable and so comfy, and I love you so much. Also, thank you so much to Baez from Tijuana for sponsoring this ass. Uh, thank you so much. I love you so much, and hopefully I get to see you again one day. <laughs> it's cold outside, but the fire keeps us warm. We can spend the night underneath the mistletoe. And I've gotten you a present. Hey guys, my name is Denise Arias, and today I'm gonna be tasting a whole bunch of holiday Starbucks drinks. I'm super excited. I don't ever know what the heck to pick every time that I go, so I just get random stuff anyway. And hopefully I find my favorite. I asked you guys on Instagram to tell me what your guys' favorite holiday drinks were, and I got some good ones. I got some of them multiple times, so of course I had to pick those. And yeah, I'm excited, let's try some drinks. So first of all, I wanna say I'm sorry for the lighting. I know it's not the best. I'm working on getting different lighting, a different camera, just different equipment. Uh, so you guys will definitely see some better productions here. And um, also, I know my forehead is super shiny and you can probably see yourself in my forehead. Like it literally looks like a mirror. And it's because I got a TCA peel at school, so my face is literally on the verge of starting to peel off. So, yeah, I actually decided to record all of that, so if you're interested in this TCA peel, chemical peel, um, definitely watch out for that video. I'm, I think I'm going to post it in maybe a week or two, just so that I give my face a chance to just peel all the way. But yeah, I'm excited to see what my new skin is going to look like. Also, make sure you watch out for the deets on my $100 giveaway. I'm going to be giving away $100 on December 25th. I also want to give you guys a little goodie bag or send you guys a little something something for Christmas. So I'm going to be giving out this little Starbucks car freshener. I know not every store has them and I think you have to have one. So yeah, I give you guys a little goodie bag or something too and with the $100 giveaway. So make sure you watch out for this, those details and you are following me on Instagram and on YouTube. But let's get started with this whole taste test. I'm excited. A lot of you guys were actually telling me to try the oat milk honey latte, but when I asked, they said they didn't have oat milk. So I don't know if I confused you guys, if you guys gave me like just a random holiday drink that you like, but I still wanted to try it. So I'm like, let me try it with almond milk and see what happens. I don't think I'm going to like it at all. I think it's going to be a little boring for me, but please, nobody get offended. Okay. I love you guys. Thank you guys for helping me out and choosing some holiday drinks. This is just, you know, these are my, ta my taste buds, okay? We just have different taste buds, that's all. And um, yeah, I just, I don't have a lot of faith in this one, okay? Uh, or hope, faith or hope, which was the correct one, I don't know. I just hope it tastes like honey. If it tastes like honey, I'll give it a good rating. Let's see. Absolutely not. No. No. Just, just, no. This is just the most, I mean, if you're thirsty and you want a little hint of like coffee, then yeah, get this. It's going to quench your thirst because it's watery as fuck. So, yeah, I, I, I don't recommend this one. Unless you're thirsty. Let me try it just one more time just, just to make sure. Oh, gross. I'm not a fan. I'm going to give this a three. Sorry. 
The price for the honey one, the honey almond milk drink was $5.45. It was, it's not worth not one penny. Now we're gonna go with the iced toasted white mocha with vanilla sweet cream cold foam, no whip, a caramel drizzle, and then they still have those little like sugary stuff on the top. So let's give this a try. This looks amazing. This looks like something I'd like, but I'm afraid it's gonna be too, too sweet. So let's see. It's really good. It's really good. I'm just not, I guess I'm not seeing where the toasted, the toasted, like what's supposed to taste toasted? Like that's what I'm trying to figure out. That's why I keep sipping it because I'm like, what is it that's supposed to taste toasted? It just tastes like vanilla to me. It's delicious. It's delicious. Um, I'm still trying to figure out where the toasted part is. I would 100% order this again. It's delicious. And I think subbing the whip with a cold foam is probably a million times better. It's really, really good. I would give this a... Nine. Just because it's not like the greatest drink I've ever tried, okay? So the price for that one was $5.25, 60 cents with the caramel drizzle, and a dollar for the cold foam. So six, 25, I'm really bad at math, six, seven, eight, 85. 685 for that drink. I'd say it's worth it, it's delicious. It would make me happy. If I had that and I was having a bad day, I would definitely go and get that. Like, it, it's really good. So this was, this one I'm really excited to try. I've tried like a regular peppermint mocha, but I haven't tried the white peppermint mocha. And I prefer white chocolate anyway, so I'm excited. It's a white peppermint mocha, iced, no whip, sub with vanilla cold foam. And it has the little chocolate chips, the shavings on top. So let's try it out. I have a lot of hope for this one. This one is delicious, like delicious. I probably have like a cold foam mustache. I have a real mustache, but like, I feel like I have a cold foam mustache now. This is really good. This is really, really good. I would 100% order this again. I will give this one a nine. Still not my favoriteest, favoriteest of all time. I will tell you guys what my favorite, 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 favorite drink that gets a whole 10 for me is. And that's a iced chai with coconut milk with pumpkin foam on top. It's so good. I love it. Or even a white mocha with pumpkin foam on top. <laughs> I love pumpkin. Like, I'm a basic ass bitch. Like, I love pumpkin spice. Have you guys ever seen those memes that's like, how to trap a white girl? How to trap a Mexican? Like a Mexican chick. And then it'll, <laughs> for like the white girl, it'll be like, 
Uggs and like <clears throat> freaking Starbucks and you know what people think basic white girls are and then for the Mexican chicks it'll be like hot Cheetos and like a cerveza well yeah I'm a mix I'm a mix of both okay I'm a basic ass Mexican chick okay and you can most definitely put some hot Cheetos a cerveza some Starbucks pumpkin spice and you can definitely trap me 100% don't forget the target I love target but I do need like a little hint of Walmart every so often you know what I mean to save money this is really good I'm gonna drink this entire thing I'm probably gonna drink this one over like all of them oh, I forgot to tell you guys the price on the other one so let me give you guys a price it is a I grande ass peppermint mocha at $5.25 and I sub with cold foam so it's $6.25 for that drink. So I have two hot drinks. I cannot figure out which one this is. I for some reason I can't get this off. I wait. Ooh, this is the one that I'm excited for. Maybe I should wait for the end for this one. Let's wait for the end, okay? Let me smell it. It sounds amazing. But let's wait. No, let's not wait. Let's not wait. Let's just go for it. So this is a spiced apple pie. Wow. My mouth is doing all types of weird things right now. Like my mouth is literally like watering. I would probably drool this is probably the most delicious drink i have ever had that is not coffee okay at starbucks wow i'm like in shock right now this is amazing like i'm literally like drooling i'm literally fucking drooling as i'm drinking this this is so good. Wow. I'm really questioning my life right now. Do I like pumpkin spice? Or do I like a spiced apple pie? More. Did I just become different? I think... I think this is my favorite. I think this is my favorite out of all the drinks I've had at Starbucks. Like, out of all of them. I give this a 10. I give this a 12. This is so fucking good. Oh my God. This 100% tops all the drinks that I've had at Starbucks. This is a 10. This is absolutely fucking delicious. This is my new guilty pleasure. So it's going to be half passion tango tea, half steamed apple juice. You're going to add three pumps of cinnamon dolce syrup. You're going to add whip and you're going to add cinnamon dolce on top. Please try it and let me know what you think. Maybe I'm like exaggerating. All right, moving on because we still have one more. But honestly, I should have just kept this for the last one because now I have like zero hope for the next one, you know? By the way, the price for that one was, oh wow, what the heck? That was super cheap. That was $2.65 plus 50 cents. So, so $3. It was like a three freaking dollar drink plus a few cents because I'm bad at math and I'm just gonna let you guys do the math for me. But yeah, wow. So maybe you guys are gonna be saving money with me if you guys really like it. All right, for the next hot drink, it's gonna be a, I actually let them choose this one. 
peppermint white mocha. So this is just a hot version of what we had basically. Let me see. Like I said, I should have left the other drink for the last drink because now I feel like I have a new favorite and I 100% prefer the other drink over like anything. So now everything that I try is going to be like, eh, you know, a little mediocre for me. I am going to say I do prefer the white mocha versus a regular mocha. You guys should definitely give that a try. It's something a little bit different. I feel like it's a little sweeter. I'll try to be fair. For a hot drink, I will definitely give this, because it's still like holiday, it still makes me happy. I'll give this um, a seven. Sorry. It's aight, you know? It's still good. He's still cute. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. And thank you for supporting me always. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you guys have other suggestions for my vlogmas, let me know. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and that you subscribe and turn on your post notifications. And I cannot wait to see you guys tomorrow because we're going to keep on going with this vlogmas. Love you guys.